What is the lymphatic system? To understand lymphedema, it helps to know a little bit about what the lymphatic system is and how it works. Lymphedema is the accumulation of lymphatic fluid in tissue. As this fluid builds up, it basically floods the tissue and causes swelling in the affected limb or area. In cancer patients, lymphedema usually results from surgery to remove lymph nodes or radiation therapy that damages these nodes. Lymph is a protein-rich fluid that originates in the tissues of your body. The Greek physician Hippocrates first described the lymph nodes as early as the 5th century BC. The Romans gave lymph its name from the Latin word for water. Lymph is carried through an extensive network of fine vessels in tissue and filtered through the lymph nodes. The lymphatic system works in close cooperation with other body systems to destroy bacteria, viruses, and other disease-causing agents, including cancer cells, and then to remove those agents along with excess fluids. The lymphatic system also works with the circulatory system to deliver nutrients, oxygen, and hormones from the blood to the cells that make up the body's tissues. We have clusters of cells called lymph nodes located throughout our bodies that act as filters and drain fluids from the tissue. There are an estimated six to 700 lymph nodes in your body with groups found in the underarm, groin, neck, and abdomen. Lymphedema occurs when the system is damaged and the lymph is unable to drain properly. The result is an accumulation of fluid in the tissue, much like the puddle that builds up when the drain in your house is blocked. This causes the tissue to swell. It's also important to understand that lymph exits the tissue through a network of tiny vessels located just near or under the skin. When bacteria enter a break in the skin, they thrive on the protein-rich fluid that is accumulated there. That's why people with lymphedema are prone to infections and need to take good care of their skin in the at-risk area. Lymphedema occurs only in the area where the lymph nodes have been damaged. In other words, if you're a breast cancer patient, your risk for lymphedema is your arm on the treated side of your chest and breast. If you have had pelvic or abdominal surgery or radiation, you may develop lymphedema in your lower limbs. While lymphedema is a chronic condition, there are many steps you can take to reduce your risk and help control it. We have very effective ways of treating this condition and assuring you can live an active life. For more detailed information, visit penmedicine.org slash lymphedema. I hope you found this video helpful. Remember, if you have any questions about lymphedema and its treatment, talk to your doctor, physical therapist, or nurse. They want to help you.